Hi, I like to talk about adhesions. Adhesions is scar tissue. Scar tissue, another word or name that we commonly use, is fibrotic or fibrous tissue. Collagen tissue is the normal uh, tissue that we have when, we're he when we have healthy collagen tissue in the, in the tissues of our body. But uh, when the collagen tissue is actually torn, the body replaces it with scar tissue. Now the difference is collagen tissue has flexibility, durability. It can stretch uh, and has actually good range of motion when you're actually moving your neck or your back or any joint in the body. But when you have the scar tissue, the fibrous tissue, you lose that flexibility. You lose that, that durability to actually stretch. A good analogy is that uh, if you have a rubber band, you overstretch the rubber band, it becomes nice and loose. But once you start putting glue or adhesiveness inside that rubber band, it becomes sticky. So as a result of that loss of movement, you then can develop lots of pain. So understand that when you have a lower back weakness, lower back trauma, neck trauma, and uh, you hurt the disc or you develop a bulging disc or herniation, it's not always the herniation or the bulging disc that causes the pain. It's the adhesions of the collagen tissue and the soft tissue uh, around that stabilizing the joint that's causing a lot of your pain. So what do you do? There are therapeutic stretches. You actually want to increase range of motion by doing therapeutic exercises depending upon your injury. But realize that because you have a herniation does not mean you need to do anything invasive. By working on the soft tissue and if you realize that there, there is progress, less pain, more increased motion, uh, then obviously that's your answer. That's fibrous tissue now that's actually being broken back down to regain that flexibility again. Make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.